Lethbridge police are warning about a phone scam after a 79-year-old woman was defrauded out of $20,000. Police say on January the 9th, the victim encountered some ransomware that locked her computer. Now, a pop-up on her screen instructed her to call a number from Microsoft, which she did. But it was actually a fraudster who told her to call the number on the back of her bank card. Now, she hung up her landline from them, but she didn't realize that she didn't hang up long enough, so the call never actually disconnected. Therefore, when she thought she was calling her bank back, the scammer was still on the line. The person pretended to be an individual from her bank and convinced her to withdraw money and put it into a Bitcoin machine. Constable Stephanie Law of Lethbridge Police Service says scammers are getting quite sophisticated and are usually several steps ahead of us. And they can do like a ringtone to make it sound like, oh yeah, I've got a dial tone. Always best practice any anytime this, you know, you get a phone call or you're directed to call somebody, hang up for at least a minute so it can disconnect. And if possible, use a different phone to call that number on the back of your card or to call the known number um, just so that there is no chance of that call not being disconnected. So just close the pop-up. Um, Microsoft isn't monitoring everybody's computer all the time, so they don't know when your computer is having a problem. If you think your computer is having a problem, don't call any numbers on pop-ups. Take it to a local place where you can hand it to them and don't deal with anybody over the phone. Constable Law says if you fall victim to a Bitcoin cryptocurrency scam to try to retain the wallet address and transaction hash or ID of where you sent the crypto, this helps them in tracing the money.